This is the second day of the games here at Ishøj at the Cup Denmark. Today all the girls of the tournament were invited to come and play with the professional players of the Swedish team LDB FC Malmö. I dream about uh, going to, going abroad to play in United States or in England for a professional team when I'm older. Gina is dreaming of becoming a professional football player. Today she had a taste of what it feels like to play with the professionals. The professional woman team from LDB FC Malmö paid Cup Denmark a visit. One of these professional players is Nila Fischer. We were here just to uh, because we are one of the uh, teams that helps uh, arrange the cup. So we're going to play, uh, play with some of the players here in the tournament and just to promote ourselves and and see some games. And another player from LDB FC Malmö is Paulina. And she and the rest of the team is here with a purpose. Everyone has some uh, strengths and some weakness. And uh, if they uh, see you as a role model, they, they start to ask and they start to learn from, from you when, when uh, you have the opportunity. And uh, every, every player is different. It's very important that they, they have the feeling to want to learn and be better all the time and as soon as you see it that they really have the ambition to be better so then uh, it's it's quite easy to to help to learn them someone needs uh, to be better with uh, its def defense and someone is is better or uh, needs to improve their technique and it's uh, simple simple things to to learn them Gina and her team played well in the matches and it's clear to her what she will bring home with her from the matches. It was really good. It was ex experience that uh, I couldn't imagine before and uh, I saw good technique and uh, they have a good footballing brain and it was a really good experience. Yeah. Both players from LDB FC Malmö are happy to be visiting the Cup Denmark. It's a lot of fun. It's you know it's just uh, great to see them play and see how happy they are to play and just uh, and we are competitive all the time. So it's just as long as you win the game, it's uh, it's great fun. Well. Uh it has to be uh, like competitive, and as soon as the girls uh, wants to be better, and 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 the, when you see that the the girls want want to learn something new from you, and you can you can be a, a role model for them, so then it's no problem. But uh, of course, uh, the levels are quite different. But uh, if you see that you can help them uh, to improve, so it feels great. But it's not all fun and games. The experience of playing with some professional women made Tina realize what it takes for her to be a player of that class. Definitely my physical abilities, fitness and uh, technique is uh, very important in football. So I just need to keep on training and thinking that I, I can do it. And it seems that Tina is right. Here is Paulina's recipe for being a professional football player. Uh, Practice and practice, uh, and they have to have patience in football. They have to uh, love football, and uh, doesn't matter if it's boy or girl. If they love the football and have uh, have the feeling, uh, they want to improve all the time and s want to spend uh, so many time as possible on the field. So it it's uh, helps them to be better players. Uh, but uh, it's very important to love football and to to try to give football everything or the sport they love. The matches with LDB FC Melmu is over and the winners are awarded with a football and some t-shirts.